Hi friends, we at Applied Course are extremely happy to announce live sessions for our interview prep course. So our interview prep course is available at interviewprep.appliedcourse.com and this is primarily for computer science engineers or other engineering students to crack software development engineer roles at both services and product based companies, right? So uh, again, we have launched this course a, a few months back and we've gotten terrific feedback from our students. Based on the feedback from our students, we also felt that live sessions are an extremely important component because today we conduct live sessions for our other courses, but we were not sure how to conduct these live sessions at, at the very launch of the course. So we also had a simple trial run where we, where we requested some of the interviewers from the industry to join us and to participate in these live sessions. So after, after some experimentation, after some feedback from our students, we thought we'll conduct these live, section, live sessions on regular basis. We'll try to conduct them on weekly basis, right? We'll try to stick to this weekly schedule. Of course, there may be one odd week where we don't have an experienced interviewer and hence we are not conducting it. But we'll try to conduct them mostly on weekly basis. And uh, we have also experimented with a few formats. And what we realized is we have a bunch of advisors uh, for, for the interview prep course. Most of them software engineers with five plus years experience and some of them even with 10 years experience, right? So we, we are planning to actually have these experienced interviewers discuss the perspective from an interviewer's viewpoint, right? So this will be mostly conducted by experienced interviewers who have, some of them even have 500 plus interviews of experience, many of them with five plus years of experience in software development across a wide spectrum of companies, right? So we do focus a lot on product-based companies because that's something that we want all of our students to eventually crack, right? So again, these live sessions are, are, are for all of our registered students. So these live sessions are accessible to all of our registered students at the interview prep course, right? So we thought, again, uh, these, are, these are the initial topics that we thought we will cover in these live sessions, but the topics of course, will evolve with time. We'll experiment new topics, we'll experiment new formats one by one, right? The way we have done for our other courses. So the, uh, when we have experienced interviewers participating in these live sessions, we would want to, we would want them to tell us about the, what is the expectation from the interviewer viewpoint, okay? This is very, very important because each interviewer is different, each company is different, each team is different. So we hope that these experienced interviewers explaining you how the interview process actually works and what the interviewer expectation is. This is very, very important. And we will cover this through some problem walkthroughs. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll request the interviewers to discuss a few problems. And for these problems, what the interviewer is expecting, what are, the, what are his own experiences when he asks similar problems in other interviews? Okay, how do candidates typically respond to these? And how does the interviewer perceive that perceive that data point or perceive the solution that the interviewee is providing, right? We'll also discuss a lot on common pitfalls that many candidates make during this interview process. So this will be, so th the most focus, so this, our focus will mostly be on the problem walkthroughs and the problem solving itself. Because in most, in most product-based companies, even in services companies, for software engineering roles, the most important aspect is solving problems, writing code, right? And get, getting or building a solution which is highly optimal both in terms of space and time complexity, writing clean code, etc., etc., etc. So instead of just hearing from one interviewer, you'll be hearing from tons of interviewers, their own experiences. Again, understanding the perspective of the interviewer gives you a lot of understanding on what they're expecting how to answer a question. So this is a very, very interesting vantage point or viewpoint that many candidates do not have, right? Similarly, we'll also try to cover a few design interview questions. This could be about low level design and high level design. We will cover a few low level design and high level design interviews and interview questions also, but uh, because this, this can help candidates with experience. So, so especially if you're, if you're a software engineer with experience, design interviews, especially for low level design and high level design, or these are also called as architecture design and object oriented design in some companies, right? So we'll all, so this is, this is mostly targeted towards experienced folks, but even if you're a fresher, if you can explain about object oriented design and architectural design, that's great, right? Right? So we're extremely happy to do this. Again, we would love to hear your feedback. 
on what other topics we can add to this because we have a phenomenal panel of interviewers and phenomenal panel of mentors who are helping us as part of this course. So looking forward to your active participation and also critical and uh, useful feedback for us so that we can increase the topics, we can, we can innovate on the format, right, and things like that.